This music is still fucking legit, dude. Alright. We're live. Again. No dropped frames. None of this fucking nonsense. Hello, piece of trash. What's up? Okay, I think we're good. Let's get this party restarted. Yeah. Anyway, um, completely forgot what we were doing. Um, what's the deal with you? The three are chatting calmly. Good. Everybody stay calm. It's not like we're gonna die. It's not in the title of the game or anything. Glad you regained consciousness, Kana. Is it? It's Kana, right? That's how you pronounce it? Thank you very much. Sorry to worry you. Kids don't gotta be all respectful. Let your feelings out as they are. What do you mean, whoa, what the fuck? This is happening. This is real life. Kidding, it's not real life. More bootleg Danganronpa? Of course! I mean, obviously. Party with me on this. Yes, thank you very much. Reko, it seems like you're enjoying yourself too. What the fuck? Why do I get an email every time I do a live stream? I already know, I'm here. I'm me. I'm doing this myself. I had to boot it all up and everything. So rude. Anyway, what the hell are we doing? Maybe there's something in the bar we missed. Your dog ate your ice cream! Oh. Dude, that's so mean. Actually, that does remind me of the time my aunt's dog, like, we were all outside eating, and I'd, I'd left my potato salad sitting on top of the cooler, and then her dog, Georgia, just came over and ate my potato salad. <sighs> it was a really good potato salad, too. The stuff that you get at Costco. It's bullshit. Anyway. We're going to the bar. Also, can dogs even eat ice cream? Hey, wait a minute. Yeah, that's right. We were... No, that- the fuck was his name? So? Whatever the fuck his name was. He was supposed to come back with something to get the bars open and he never did, so, like, what the fuck happened to him? Where the shit is he? No, go inside. Why can't I go inside there? Why is it not letting me go into the room now? Cool. Nagito is ultimate bartender now. I know, right? He has the exact same hair as Nagito. I guess the bar, then. What the hell? What is that? What are you talking about? That cigar! A miner can't be carrying around such a thing. I wasn't going to smoke it. I thought it might be a clue. Is that so? Apologies for my suspicion. Hmm, it seems I slip into teaching mode whenever I see a student. However, well, let's see. Yes, could you let me hold on to that? I'm telling you I won't smoke it. Hand the cigar over to Professor Mishima. Alright, fine, he can keep it. What's up, kiddo? He's right. <laughs> Alright. Anything else? What about the names that we don't know? <laughs> Anything else? Come on. What 
fuck is that? Ugh, I hate this bar. I'm the opposite of Toby Keith. I hate this bar. Hold up, let me... Zero G, so I would imagine that like if I get money I'd use it at the vending machine. Anyway. Now what? The red room is still locked. Okay. still got a gun. What's the hole in the center for? Wasn't that for the dart? We've done this. God, I hate this. Yeah, it's got the cigarettes. Smoking area. What am I missing here? out, man. And it won't let me go through the door. I don't understand. What? Okay, whatever. That was weird. Anyway. What if I just light it on fire? What the fuck? Where the shit is so? Hey man, this is pink. I had a bedroom that was this pink. It was like my family. We moved into a house that was still being built. Like, we bought it as it was being built, and we were able to, like, choose the color of our bedrooms, and my sister went with a very reasonable blue color. I went with, specifically the color was balloon pink. I loved it. Anyway. I don't understand. Yeah, we've, we've seen this. Where the fuck is everyone? Somebody fucking help me. Okay. Dude, do you want to check out this lighter? <laughs> oh my- of course. Indeed, did you find it somewhere? Yes, in the cafeteria. Perhaps you mean to light up a- Well, I'm not going to smoke. He smokes, doesn't he? He's bizarrely wary of underage smoking. Handed the lighter over to Professor Mishima. Anything else? I've got a gun. Do you want that too? Where the fuck is so? Okay. I've given him all that stuff. Something's gotta happen now, right? Right? <laughs> A discovery announcement. I wish. A 
I don't... I don't... What? Come on. God damn it, I never got this lost in a Danganronpa game. Why don't I just shoot the window open? Do I have any bullets left? Elegant chandelier. <sighs> Come on. Dude. Now what? <laughs> Where the fuck is everybody? <sighs> Everyone's dead. That would make sense. If there's many exits out of the room, then why do we only take fucking three of them? Like, the bar is the only place we haven't, like, had anything happen. Like, what the fuck? Oh, you fucker. A sliding door. Open the fucking door. I'm so over this. If So's in there, I'm gonna kill him. Ooh, that was one stiff door. What the fuck is in there? Maybe there's some clue in there. Hmm, what's this? Tained a cigar cutter. I think I saw this online once. It's a tool for cutting cigars to smoke them. Word up. Why were you looking that up online? Don't smoke, Sarah. Do I look like I would? Oh, more importantly, there's something bigger in the back. It's an arm, isn't it? Ah, it's a leg. Looks like this one's a doll limb, too. Take it, Joe. Why are you so calm? Good shit. Are we done? Is that all of them? Did we get all of them? Fuck's sake. Alright, we gotta do something with the cigar cutter. I get it. Now I get it. I'm not absolutely terrible at this game. This game's lucky the music is a fucking bop, though. Anyway. Yo, Mishima, you wanna do something with this? What is that? Huh? You mean the cigar cutter? Precisely. It's a tool used for smoking cigars. <laughs> I love how this is like the main thread of this of this particular mystery that everybody thinks she's going to smoke. <laughs> Are you going to smoke a cigar? Out of the question for a teacher to smoke. As long as you're an adult, I think it's fine. Like, seriously, dude. <laughs> Professor Mishima, did something good happen? What are you speaking of? There's nothing, indeed. Like, maybe you're happy about this cigar? A teacher like myself would not smoke. Incite him. I want him to- I want to inspect the cigar. I wonder, is that cigar really just a luxury item being provided to us? What do you mean to say? Maybe there's some meaning to it. Sometimes a cigar is just a cigar. Would you let me inspect it a little? I get it, that's true. We should investigate it closely. Let us try using the cutter on this cigar. Oh, what is this? There was a bill inside the cigar. Hey, We figuring this shit out! Mr. Facts. 
What a relief. Smoking is bad for you, after all. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. He's visibly disappointed. Sarah, please take the unused lighter in this thousand yen bill. When I really think about it, you will likely find more use for them. So he did intend to use the lighter. <laughs> Sorry, Mishima. Not today. Anyway. Yes. What are we buying? Ah. Whoa. Is that a doll arm? It's way too realistic. Wish they'd cut it out. Okay, great. That's gotta be everything, right? A thousand yen. Yeah, I know, right? Okay, anyway. Seriously. Everybody else just vanished. Where the shit did So go? Is he already dead? Is he gonna be the next ultimate survivor? Because I don't know if I can handle that. Head, left arm, right arm, left leg, right leg. This should be everything. Should I attach them? Prepare myself first. You're right. No, seriously, what the hell happened to So? Well now, we're finally doing it. Hey, actually, where have you even been? Oh, just found a hidden room. Of course, they went through one of those 50,000 other exits. Maybe. Maybe they did that, huh? Did they maybe do that? Is that what happened? Now you're telling me? So, you're okay. That's my line. Good, so everyone's safe. I know. My heart is beating fast. What could possibly happen? So when Keiji got it on, oh, you shipping it? I got the door open just in case. So our escape route's secured. Well, on to the fateful moment. Let's roll. Eiji skillfully attached the parts to the doll torso placed there. Right arm, left arm, right leg, left leg, and the head. Let's see here. Okay. Hello, Gabriel. Nothing's happening? Wait, you smell something? Huh? Hey, is it just me or is the room going white? It's gas! Poison? Not good, we need to leave the room. But the white gas filled up the room in the blink of an eye. I can't see anything. I can't even see past my own hands. There's nowhere to run. Are we all going to suffocate? I'm not prepared. It's not poison gas, everyone, so please relax. Oh my god. Are you fucking serious? That's fucking weird, y'all. Ah, <laughs> good day. Huh? You're... the doll? Hee hee hee. Yes, I am the doll that you just rescued. Advanced, am I not? Huh? What the hell's going on here? The doll is a girl, ew. Yeah. She's a waifu. I don't like to say it, but you know that it's true. Ahaha, as it happens, I have revived to tell you what is happening and support you through the trials and tribulations to come. Stay away from me, you creepy-ass puppet. Hehehe, <laughs> there is nothing to fear, you see. I will offer you all support. Uh, <sighs> is there no one who can speak calmly here? An acquired taste. True facts. It's a step too far to ask someone not to be surprised when a doll starts talking. Talk to her calmly. I'll ask. Just what are you? Tell the friendly policeman, too. I'm not really following here. Hehehe. <laughs> then we'll begin with my introduction. Hee <laughs> hee. My name is... Sue Miley? What? Alright. The Laughing Doll. I'm the doll who will guide you on this floor. Floor? Oh god, I don't think I'm ready for this. Alright, hold up a second. 
Oh, smiley. I get it. That's creepy. She's gonna kill one of us. My master has instructed me to guide you brave souls who have already overcome several trials to the main game. Oh, no. She's gonna tell Kana that she could have saved her sister, isn't she? She's gonna do that. <sighs> Alright. Your master. In other words, you're on the side of the kidnappers. So you're our enemy? Don't try and say you're not. Ahaha, <laughs> how very serious. Ahaha. <laughs> Stop laughing, asshole. You wanna die? What's the game called? Your turn to die. I understand I may have buried I may have buried the title a little bit there. Cause um well I did have it as the title of the live stream last time, but you know. YouTube doesn't have this game in its database. And the thumbnail's in Japanese, so I guess I screwed everyone over, but it is your turn to die. I'm here, I'm a cat, and I'm excited about this stream. Good for you, Kit Kat. Good for you. Hee <laughs> hee, I'd rather not. No, I wouldn't like to be all torn up again. I know, I just have to tear you up first. Tear us up? As a warning, yes. Oh, who got the phone? Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. Not the exploding collars. We can't do this. Not again. What did you do? What indeed? Hey, answer me. Oh, very well. I'm just making your collar explode. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Huh? No way. What? Shit. We're fucked. Get away. Get away. It's dangerous. No, no, no way. You got me good, game. You got me good. That was a lie, of course. Did you enjoy it? Uh, a lie. Joe's knees gave out and he collapsed on the floor. <laughs> yeah, I know, total bitch. Oh. Uh... She's a psycho. That collar can't actually explode after all. I guess. I mean, I was going by anime logic, but clearly something that small would, like, not be able to contain the chemicals needed to explode, so... Hello, Jeff. You piece of shit. Evil laughter. It's so funny, I can't even talk. She's out of her mind. Out of her mind. Or not human to begin with. But it seems we should do as she says. Why kidnap us? You don't know, do you? What I'm about to explain is in regards to a fight you must take for your own destiny. You will soon undergo a great trial in order to escape outside. As it has been prior, a superior will live, and the inferior will die. It is far from easy. One among you will certainly die. And the person to die shall be decided by your own majority vote. Eh? I'm saying that you'll pick it yourselves. The one most unnecessary, hated, and acceptable to have die. Oh, it's gonna be the stalker, isn't it? You sort out your wedding date. Oh, congratulations. I know, like... Well, I don't know much about weddings, but I've seen a lot of shows about weddings. I've watched Say Yes to the Dress. I know, like, weddings are really... They take forever to get sorted and shit. I don't know. I'd say I've been in a wedding, but my job was just, like, handing out the pamphlets, so, you know. 
I was too old to be a flower girl. I was so disappointed. Then by all means, starve to death here, all of you. Wow, yeah, that's right, we don't have any food. Whoa, just laying it on the table. Pick one of us? I know who I'm choosing. What is she saying? I can't comprehend. Not one of us could speak up anymore. We would kill one of these people stuck in the same situation who we had considered allies? Or else we would be killed by them? Why? Why doesn't this feel real? Don't go so pale, everyone. I've got something good to hand out. Something good? My head won't work. I hardly understand what she's saying. What the fuck is happening in this game? Ah, I haven't uploaded the replay of last episode yet. I'll get on that later. Here, Sarah Chidoan. Have this tablet. A voting tablet. Aww. It's not the, uh... Fuck, what's it called? <sighs> Damn it. I forgot what it was called. E-handbook? Is that what it's called? Fuck it. Does everyone have no one now? Let us test the functionality with some actual use. When voting, if you know who voted for who, it turns into a quarrel, doesn't it? Thus, by voting with these tablets, you won't know who made what vote. As a test, try voting for whoever. Well, this is a real shitty situation. What happens if I vote for myself? What happens? Joe, one vote. Okay, what? Kana, one vote. Did everybody vote for themselves? Um. Um. Okay. Mishima? Wow. That's fucking mean. No. Are they actually gonna kill him? Oh my, it appears to be a bit one-sided. So this is a tablet for voting. Is there something you want to say? If you were a human, I suppose there would be something like cease this if you have a heart. Unfortunately, I do not. A pity. More importantly, are you sure? Hmm? No! Do you really want those as your last words? Oh no! Oh no! No. What are you doing? It won't explode, will it? <laughs> no, it won't explode. What did you say? P professor? No, oh my god, no. Oh no, what? Dude! Before she does this, it's just a prank bro thing again. No! Oh my god! Is he gonna melt his head off? Professor Mishima. A smell lingered in the air. A smell I'd never experienced before. The smell of human flesh burning and the sound of blood evaporating. Oh shit! And then the professor stopped moving at all. Oh my god! 
Holy shit. Okay, to be fair, there wasn't anything I could have done about that. I voted for myself. I didn't think she was fucking serious. She said we were just testing it out. This is bullshit. 20 fuckers did this. Sue Miley is the new Monokuma. Oh, okay, that's gross. If everyone just votes for themselves, what does that do? You've learned what a majority vote means from this experience, haven't you? Awful. This is too awful. It wasn't an instant pain. He was burned at length. And unable to even writhe, he died. Everyone... Everyone's a good person here. How can you do this? What did we do? I won't let this stand. You annoy me, you powerless little girl. No. You sister- Oh, I called it. I called it. I called that. I called that. I called that. I called that. It's the ninth man all over again. Yeah, I guess. No! 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 Oh, I wasn't prepared to deal with these consequences. I knew it would happen. But I wasn't prepared. I saw all of it. How miserable you were in your first trial, Kana. Don't trample on her. On Professor Mishima's concern for Kana. On the words he left her. Your actions killed your sister. Don't trample all over Kana's heart. What? Who did that? Oh my god! Now I don't know what to feel, because apparently this guy is a, is a stalker, but also... what? Forgive me, the hand with the frying pan must have slipped. You little... So even dolls bleed red. Oh my god. Can we kill the doll? Don't think you can do this and just get away scot-free. On the contrary, I ask that you don't think you'll be getting away with so little as this. I will have you pay for toying with people's lives. Damn it. Damn it. I'll remember this. I'll be waiting on the grounds of the main game. Are you all right? I don't understand. Professor Mishima's death, nor who Kai is. I know, right? I don't get it, man. This is fucking crazy. But, yes, even if what awaits is us killing each other by majority vote, however cruel a future it is, I can't... I can't go dying yet. Oh, shit! Was that it? Chapter 1, Part 1, end. Alright, that's fair. We get like a cool credits roll or anything. Yes. Part two, hoes. We in part two. Part two, bitches. What the fuck happened? I don't, I don't want to spoil it for you, Diego. Just rewind the stream. Now. Miss Now. You look pale, Miss Now. Professor, I, I... I feel like I'll never pass. Miss Now, what's the matter? Exams are a ways away yet, and I'm sure you'll be fine, Miss Now. I can't. If I fail, I, what'll I even do? Hmm. Please calm down, I'm busy driving. Maybe I'll swallow a bunch of mud and die? It seems you feel quite cornered. Uh, Miss Now, to tell the truth, I failed my college exams. Huh? You did, Professor? Yes, indeed. I had grades as good as anyone's, and a more or less serious lifestyle. I put in a perfectly good effort, at least I believe so. However, where some will pass, others will fail. There's nothing that can be done about it. And being more conceited than the average person, I lashed out at everything. 
However, people can always improve themselves. So, Miss Now, what do you suppose gives people the impetus to improve? Okay, none of those things. Like... Like, none of these. I guess... Family and friends, whatever? My, my, I wasn't asking you to give the model answer, you know. But still, how wonderful. It must speak to your purity that you can honestly embrace the words of others in any situation. It's just more anime zero escape. I guess kind of, but there's no room escape games. Perhaps that is why your friends are all such good people, Miss Now. Well, in my case, it was time. It required an above, an above average amount of time, but I regained the courage to face forward. And such is why now I enjoy my time with you and, and the rest of the class. Though I failed, I gained happiness. The dream I had pictured did not come to pass, but the reality I found was much like a dream. Professor, there's nothing to fear in failure. A person's life does not end there. As long as you live on, happiness will surely come to you. Ooh, ooh, this is sad. You're hurting me. Who the fuck voted for him? So, what happened to the doll? Did she just, like, crawl into the heart-shaped vent? Because of our votes. Disp- <laughs> It sure does. It sure does. We keep our distance. Now alone sits near Professor Mishima. How should I sort out these feelings? I can't think of what to say to now. Ooh, do I really have to say anything? Every time I've tried to comfort somebody who's had a friend die, just like... I fucked it up horribly. Probably the two that didn't get votes. Yeah, I'd buy that. It seems... I get the feeling that, like, everybody thought it was just a test, so they voted for themselves. Feels that way. But, like, honestly, there was nothing I could have done to prevent that. Stop being antisocial. Ugh. Fuck's sake. What about the professor? I'm afraid to come any closer. I'm leaving. Suddenly, as I look toward the exit. Damn it, she got us. So? Miss Sarah, look at this. So slowly close the door to the room. There's a message here. Read it, Miss Sarah. The second trial, practice round. This is a practice for the main game, the start is signaled by the doll's revival. Follow instructions and hold a majority vote. The one with the most votes is to be sacrificed. However, this is a practice round. If the votes come to a draw, the game is forfeit. Fuck! That's what I was fucking saying! Why didn't everybody just vote for themselves? I'm so fucking mad. Because, like, there's no choice I could have taken that would have solved this issue. Fuck. Being railroaded into this. What? The second trial. It's named just like the first one we did. We never noticed this note? I wasn't allowed to turn around. Damn it, it's all because I said to keep the door open in case there was danger. We were clearly led into doing so. This room had an ominous air even before entering. What happens if there's a draw and it's not a practice round? I don't know, probably everyone dies. The game's forfeit if it's a draw? Then don't tell me. If everyone had gotten the same votes, there'd be no victim. Is that right? You're kidding me, so we died for nothing? It was an avoidable trap if we'd just checked the door. 
Professor Mishima. I'm worried about now. Yeah, I know, but like, you didn't want to talk to her before. This is just a lie, right? Professor. Ooh. Bro. I was not prepared for that, no. I really just like when games give the illusion of an important choice and then you just get dicked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I, I can't, I can't even. Yeah, that's just fucking terrifying. No, you gotta stop now. You, 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 oh! Dude. You know, you know, I gotta give credit. Dangan Ropa never went there. So glad to watch this at 1 a.m. <laughs> oh, yeah. No! Now, don't touch that. The old guy. Don't look in, stay away. Damn it, what the hell? Who who voted for Mishima? Shut up, you eyesore. Huh? I mean, it's because of the votes, see. It's always possible everybody voted for someone sides themselves, you know. Settle down now. Listen, everybody. Don't do any probing into each other's votes. But we voted without knowing a thing. No one had any ill will. You'd know that, right, Sarah? Damn it! I get the feeling that the people with no votes for themselves voted for Mishima. I do get that feeling. But nobody saw the note. I want to agree with Keiji, but I'm so filled with rage. Missed the last stream because it was passed out. That yeah, sounds about right. Been up since 10. Wow. Early start, huh? Uh, I, I guess Katie's right. We shouldn't talk about the votes, Joe. I got it. Just let me be alone for a sec. That's fair. I'll give him that. All the others. Some left, some stayed. They all began to scatter their own ways. Okay, can we get the kid away from the dead body? He's like 10. Come on. Again, I know how you feel, but you shouldn't be here. It was just for a little bit, but we were searching together. Damn. What about you? Stand silently. Yeah, she's just having a problem. Um, so what's what's your fucking deal, man? This game is a little too anime for your taste, Jess. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're so you're so you're such an elite an elitist consumer. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, man. It's not high standards enough. Like this. This game doesn't reach your high standard of entertainment. <laughs> 10 p.m. last night. Oh, why? Yellow hair dude makes me uneasy. Same. Just pisses me off now. Someone just died and KG is still holding his fucking neck. Yeah, I know. He just saw what that collar can do. He should be keep he should want to keep everything away from his neck just in case he sets it off by accident. They all need time to think right now. So do you, Sarah. Me too, of course. I'm sure everybody will come back. And the body... I'm just gonna go... 
had to drive two hours for a, for a training thing and back. Damn. All right. Kai, you are a suspicious motherfucker. It is locked. Perhaps there's nothing to be done. Kai, what are you doing? I was thinking of ways to enter the kitchen. It has not yet been checked, you see. You're so calm. Is this person really my stalker? I thought if he was the stalker, he'd be with the kidnappers. But when he hit Miley, I sensed undeniable hostility. Kai was angry. Miss Sarah, or Kai, are you... What the f... Miss Sarah, are you alright? Hey, is that a glow-in-the-dark thing down there? We got crypt we got kryptonite here, of course. Or are they on a ship right now? This looks like a banquet hall. Ooh, it could be a ship, but I think it's just a building. I'm fine. It may be a trap. Let us look for the switch. What the fuck is that thing? Look closely at it. There are glowing letters using fluorescent paint. They're on some sort of paper. It's a card? The one who claims this. This now belongs to you. Keep it on you always. This is a key to the exit. Let no one else know the existence of this card. Otherwise, you will die. What is this? Miss Sarah, are you unharmed? I hid the card before I could even think. I'm okay. Looks like the lights came on. Let us look at the other rooms to see if anything occurred in that moment. Look on the back. Keymaster! What's this game called? It's called Your Turn to Die. I know I'll mess that up, man. The freaking thumbnails in Japanese. I should have known better. <laughs> it's the glowing paper from when Fat Kuya died. <laughs> oh my god, the both of you. Friggin' two Yami. Jesus. Keymaster. The other text seemed to disappear, so what does Keymaster mean? Um, well, there was that thing with the gatekeeper and, I don't know, that friggin' building in New York and the Ghostbusters had to... Yeah, whatever. I feel like I'm being led by them again. Well, this sucks. <gasps> A staircase! Where there had been nothing before, now there were stairs. Is this another trap? Yo, what's up, So? I know you fucking voted for Mishima. Look, Miss Sarah, there are stairs here now. I wonder where they lead. I don't know, but... Miley left a few spots of blood. I'm sure she went up there. Miley? Did anyone else go up? I only just got here, so I don't know. Has anyone gone missing? I can't imagine anyone would go up these stairs on their own, but... You aren't thinking of going up, are you, Miss Sarah? I'm telling you for your own good. You should refrain for now. More importantly, there's something I want to show you. Eh? Come to the back of the cafeteria. Please. I wonder what he wants to show me. Alright, so told me to come here, but... Miss Sarah, this way, this way, I'm over here. What? So, is that you? I held the lighter in the direction of his voice. Ah! Secret door! Hit me the fuck up, go to the secret door! They bragged about having a female protagonist. I don't know why they would. I mean, like... I feel like the protagonists for death games are like sort of like an intentionally blank slate. She's a basic bitch. Yeah, I mean really, like she has a stalker this whole time, like she didn't even mention it until like she kind of mentioned it out of no nowhere really. Dark, isn't it? There's only the light from that stand. What did you want to show me in this place? Check what's on the desk. Is it a computer? 
It's a laptop computer. You could just say a laptop. Don't be weird. Very intriguing, right? I did try starting it up, but there's no power, power cord, and it seems to be running on battery power. So once the battery's dead, it's over. I want to investigate what's on it, but... Right. This might be a trap, too. I'm aware of that, but we can't not investigate it, you know? However, there's a problem. This laptop is locked with a password, so you can't see what's stored on it. I tried some random passwords, but all I accomplished was draining the battery. You got any ideas? Someone's name? Ah, that's a possibility. And if it opens with someone's name, there's a good chance they're the laptop's owner. But if it's a name we don't know, there'd be no way for us to learn it. It'd be best if we could just conveniently find a piece of paper with the password. Yeah, you feel me? Now that would definitely be a trap. Yeah. Hmm, if we just had a hint. Ah, a hint, huh? Maybe this is a hint from the kidnappers. What do you mean? There's probably information on here that's valuable to us, but worthless to them. Solve the riddle and we'll generously give it out. If you can, it doesn't matter to us. Like that. And we can't see it once the battery goes dead, so it's like a time-limited treasure chest. I can't see them being that kind. Okay, I'm going to stay here and work on figuring out the password. Miss Sarah, tell me if you find any clues. <laughs> Cap on one cup bishy five, but poor gourmet got left out. They made gourmet even worse. Like, I don't even know how they managed it. We need to have hope. It is that kind of game. What the fuck is back here, then? Ah, dumb. KG was here. Fine, I'm leaving. We've got other shit to do. <laughs> they were gonna make him a twink, but no, he's a demon. Ah, yes. Staying true to its roots. Anyway, what the heck is up, Kutaro? Now when this get here? Don't tell me these stairs lead to the main game grounds. Don't know about that, but whatever the case, but we gotta go. Damn it, it's just gonna be a trap anyhow. What do you think, Sarah? Everyone's on edge right now. If we go, we should get everyone together first. But you heard about the main game, right? We're gonna pick one of us to die. I mean, we already did that, but go off, I guess. Of course, I don't want to take part in it, but how are we supposed to feel any unity? You might have a point, but... Damn it! Alright, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna try and believe in you. We'll go up here when everyone's assembled. Anybody tries to go up on their own, I'll catch him, but good. Please don't be rough, okay? Anyway, to the bar. Who's drinking tonight? Ooh. I would imagine there aren't any washrooms in this place either. That poor kid. Damn puppet, as if you've even got a change of clothes. You two... Oh, ooh, ooh. She knows I lied. She knows I lied. I'm really excited to see the next death. Is it why you gotta be like that? Not a huge fan of this pixel art style for a death game. I think a realistic art style, at least for the pack room, would work better. Eh. Oh no! She hates me now. I lied to Kana. Because of that lie, I deeply wounded Kana's heart. Sister killer. It's all because Miley said that awful thing. Hey Sarah, you think you could look for something Kana could wear? No problem. Ooh, this is sad. This game is kind of weirding you out. Well, it's an RPG maker game, like, honestly. That's just how it is. Oh! He getting smashed? Joe sits alone, hanging his head. Wants to be left alone, huh? Leave him in silence. I can't talk to him right now. Oh, Sarah. Ah, oh, you noticed me, Joe. 
kind of calming here somehow. Have we seen that pose before? Wonder why. I've never had a drink in my life. Hey, Sarah. Do you really think Keiji's a cop? No, I do not. I do not at all. I don't believe he's a cop. Not even a little bit. Eh? Joe, have you been doubting it this whole time? I mean, just wanted your opinion, Sarah. He's so fucking lying. For real? What makes you think so? It's just a hunch, I guess? I feel like no policeman acts like that. Well, there's cops in plain clothes. I don't think it's good to suspect, just... Huh? So you do believe in him, Joe? Me... I can't think there's someone siding with the kidnappers among that bunch. Huh? Now that's strange. Wasn't Joe the first one to suggest there was? The mo but the more I try to believe, the more suspicious I get. Listen, Sarah. Could you look into KG a little? Me? Nap, sorry. Yeah, pretend I never asked. Because he wants to believe, he suspects. We've got a mastermind, I guess? <laughs> One thing's for sure, it's better if we know more about each other. For my own survival, too. Whoa! Sarah? It it's nothing. What am I thinking? Leave it to me, Joe. You serious? Don't push yourself too much, Sarah. Damn. KG looks like a Dexter kind of dude that works with police but has a secret murder dungeon. Ooh, he might be. It's Junko Enoshima. If I see any blonde girl with pigtails around here, I've got a gun and a lighter. We're setting this bitch on fire. Okay. Oh yeah, what about the red room? Ooh, who's in here? Um... Okay, it's your deal. Huh. Hey, where'd all the dolls go? Seriously, though, why is she wearing a bucket on her head? Kana sitting in the chair. This is... a doll? Yo, what the fuck? I can't see the parts hidden under clothes, but everything seems disturbingly detailed. On the doll's hand is written, please use as you wish. Don't go there, game. Don't go there. Don't- don't do this. Don't do this. I told you not to do this! Try moving it. I'll be as heavy as the actual person. Uh, Alright. Even if it's a doll, it feels awkward to just leave it here. I place the- Kana doll in a discreet spot. Sorry, Miss Doll. That's weird. That's fucking weird. Like, how did they- how did they? How did they? Whatever. Fuck it. Anyway, they were in the passage to the bar, right? Found anything Kana could wear? I found this in the blue room. What? Ain't this the exact same uniform? Creepy. Why the hell have they got stuff like this prepared? Thank you very much. Speak gently. Kana. Kana moved away from me with a start. Hey, Kana, easy now. What's up? I'm sorry. Please don't be nice to me anymore. I'm afraid of having hope. No! The despair claims another victim. Ah. Uh... Sorry. 
Sarah, hey, what's the deal? Mm, mm, mm. Maybe I should, maybe I should. What, what do you think she'd say? She might, she might kill me. Do it. I'm scared. I'm sure Rekka will tell me I should have told the truth then. But I... Sarah, look me in the eye. Don't sit over- don't sit there and brood over crap. Eh? Talk to me. Or are you just not listening to what I say? Fuck this up, keep silent. <laughs> Too late! I understand. Mishima said that? It's my fault, yeah. I said- I- I was the one that did that, yeah. Cut it out! Don't say that shit! Did you mean to hurt her? Of course not, right? Sure, Mishima was the first to lie, and I don't know if that was right or not. But guess what? There was hope in Kana's eyes. You know how hard it is to show hope to a person whose heart has been snapped? Damn it, why... Why'd I go calling Mishima a nutty professor? I go... I guess it ain't fair to decide he's no good just cause he's a man. I get the sitch now. I'll back Kana up, Sarah. It's what we do now that's important, right? Yes. Alright, we figured shit out. Way to go. Anyway, I guess we gotta go talk to Keiji again. You don't trust her? Alright, fair enough. I think she's genuine, but she is a musician, so... What's up, KG? Yeah. Anything else? Okay, that's weird. You doing alright? Okay, well, I don't know what I'm doing. What happened to Kai, anyway? Let's go to the hidden room. Okay, whatever. Is there a dead body surrounded by children? Uh, he died in the death game. Put aside the horniness and look at the facts. I don't know, man. What are the facts? Yeah, alright. You doing anything? Can I take any booze? Ah, fucking fruit flies. Do you have a Pac-Man necklace? Maybe. Thinking of kidnapping a bunch of people and making them play a game where if they lose, they get their eardrums blown out. I'm calling it the deaf game. <laughs> and a McDonald's colors game. Alright, fair enough. Uh, I guess check the game room again? Like, if I fucking walk in there and... Hey, what the fuck? Is there just a figure there? Hell yeah, there was! Yo, who the shit was that? The lights again. What the fuck? Go 
out for someone. Is somebody there? I'm uneasy about acting alone. I might want to head back for now. Turn around and find the door it shut. Won't open. I've been locked in. I see you, dude in the painting. You there again. Or maybe he's inside the teddy bear. Spooky. What is it with you and fruit flies? Are they invading your home? Constantly. And I don't know why. I don't have any fucking fruit in here. Notes of some kind are scattered about. These people who died before? Professor Mishima's name is on this, along with some people I don't know. Alice Yabusami? I'll hold on to this. Hey, a candle! Light it up! Light it up! Light it up! Need save? Good idea. Did that actually work? Okay, great. I haven't saved in like a half hour. Oh god, what's in the fucking bear? It's moving. I'm not ready for this. Why? Get, get the bottle. Have a weapon. Oh god! Oh no, I'm not ready for this. This is gonna turn into the fucking witch house, isn't it? Let's get a fly trap or just mix sugar. I do! I- I have a fucking trap. It's- it's apple cider vinegar with a couple drops of dish soap in it. And for extra destruction points, I put sticky paper on the edges of it to catch the flies that don't jump into the liquid. There's a whole shitload of them. They're- they're all over the trap. They're all dead. They just keep coming. Anyway, I'm fucking terrified. What about the clock? What the hell is this? What the hell is that? What about this? What about that? I'll move the desk over. What the hell? Declare war on them. Slay their leadership. What about the candle? Seems it's designed so I can't carry it. Alright, fine. Whatever. Fucking asshole. The bear? I don't think so. I'll wipe it with the other paper I picked up that doesn't seem very useful. Something came out of its mouth. Ooh. Alright, cool. Open that shit up. Shoot the bear. I don't have any bullets left. There's another tool. An Allen wrench. Oh shit. What the fuck is that? Gross. Rose. Oh, I see. Oh, nice. Yeah, what's in there? I pour some water down there. Something floated to the top. What is it? Tool and nail puller. Gross. This was no room escape game. Me neither. Shut up. It's supposed to be death games. Nothing like this has happened before. Also, this is way easier than, like, an escape game, okay? If it was an escape game, I would be stuck here for hours.
kill the bear. <laughs> Alright. Nope, can't kill the bear. Sorry. Nothing is left in the box. What about the table? What about the fucking table? This definitely looks like an escape game on a free flash website. Oh, you cut me deep, Jess. Yeah, it's Oh, look at that. It stopped at 28.75. That's not a real time. Yeah, get the fucker. Two needles. Uh huh. Okay. Something that would scare me back when I was eight and played Flash Games to Google for mini clip. Huh. Oh. So. I'm a little bit confused here. Um. So if it's 28, then it should be like four. What was the other one? Okay, hold on. Let me look at the let me look at the clock again. Twenty eight seventy five. Yeah, that should have been right then. Twenty eight seventy five. I don't understand what I've done wrong. Yeah, you can tell me, Neo. Otherwise, it's gonna take me about approximately 6,000 years to figure this out. 28. Like, is it two and then eight? It's 515. What? That doesn't make any sense. Why would it be 515? Why wouldn't it be 415? I don't get it. Alright, let's get this bitch off the wall. Remove the painting. Word up. I see you. Yeah, boy. Who's in there? Who the fuck is in there? He's gonna. Be oh my god. Who what the fuck? Who the fuck are you? What? What the fuck? What? No. The dude on the floor. I don't know if he's a good person, but he said help. And I'll take him with me. He doesn't seem to be hurt, but I should be delicate. Then can we Is the door open now? Alright, cool. Ah, Sarah. Wait, what the what's that? He suddenly fainted as soon as he saw me. Joe, give me a hand. Yeah, let's let's go. Hey everybody, some serious shit is going on here. Hey, what the hell's with that guy? He lost consciousness. Okay, cool. Who the fuck knows anything? Collected man. I don't fucking know. Let's go talk to the cop. Maybe he knows something. Sarah, is that... What? 
the hell is this about? That guy on your shoulder. Lend me a hand, please. You see, I told them what happened in the red room. Relax, he's just fainted. Who in the world is this guy? He's got a collar. A collar? Why are those the only two options? Would be nice. As the friendly neighborhood policeman, though, I'm wary about how we haven't seen him before. That's true. Was he in the red room this whole time? It'll be hard to figure out his situation until he wakes up. As long as he doesn't move, should be fine. Once he's up, let's leisurely question him. As I felt a bit of relief, my attention unavoidably turned to the, toward the situation in the room. Yes, the two kids looking at a dead body. Uh, Keiji, are now and Gin still... Yeah, still the same as ever. They haven't moved an inch. Hurts me to see, too. Yeah... This motherfucker ain't a cop. I'm bu I'm... The way he keeps saying, as your friendly neighborhood policeman, and keeps actively pointing out how he's working with the police... I don't believe him. It's hard, but somebody's gotta do it, and I just so happen to be a pro. Though this is my first time investigating a body I once talked to. It is hard for you after all, huh? These are sounding like very convenient excuses to me. Dummy. Now's got it a million times worse. Losing somebody she respects? Man. Um, is there someone you respect, KG? Maybe there was. A message for those in the room. Please exit the room quickly to allow for retrieval of the corpse. Retrieval of the corpse? Don't be ridiculous. I won't... I won't give the professor to anyone. Defiance will not be tolerated. Beginning fog dissemination. Not again! That gas again! No, stop. Please stop. The professor isn't dead at all. Oh... No! Don't do this. Don't. No! Oh, no! Oh my god. That's fucked up! She's gonna die. She's gonna die. Now this is no good. Yeah, it's, it's Jesus, holy shit. What's in the fucking box indeed? This music is really annoying. It's action suspense music. Don't be a dick. As your friendly non-murdering normal police officer with no cannibalistic tendencies whatsoever. Where'd she go? Did she go up the stairs? Oh, f are you serious? We're going up the stairs already? We're doing this? Where the fuck is Kai? Central Hall. Okay, well, Q- This is bullshit. Kutaro should have been, like... He should have been able to stop her. He's, like, three times her size. Did he go to the second floor? what we do? Let's all... Fuck it, let's all go up there. Wait, what if she's on the first floor? I'll search down here and you two look upstairs. Please, KG. Gotcha. Come back right away if you find her, Sarah. This is bullshit. My choices have no meaning. I can feel the suspense coursing through my veins. Oh, I don't like the look of this floor. I'm not a fan of this at all. This is bad. This is real bad. Ugh. Jesus. Save again in a different s slot. Alright. This is the second floor, huh? Lots of doors. Where could she have gone? All right, fine, I'll save. In a different slot. What the fuck? Okay. Very good. Anyway, um, back to this. What? 
Yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. Yo, what the fuck is that? Fucking club penguin reject. I'm not a penguin. What? Yo, what? It fucking talked, yo. Okay, well, she's clearly not in here. Row. Okay. Again? Yo, how the fuck? <laughs> Say, Sarah, since we're alone and I'm a friendly neighborhood police officer, would you mind blindfolding yourself and standing still while I find something sharp? Yeah, it feels that way, doesn't it? I was looking for Big Sis now. An iron cage? How can we... Uh, I wouldn't go touching that. Uh, it's sinking lower and lower. Oh, fuck. Lifting up the cage probably isn't gonna help, but, like... We can't do anything about the cage. Shit. The cage stopped, completely buried in the ground. It's not budging. What should I... There, maybe? Huh? Oh! How convenient. How did you find that? Fuck it, let's go to the ladder. You're just gonna do that to a fucking ten-year-old. Yeah, he's fine. Look at him. Again, are you okay? Why isn't he saying anything? Appears to be a computer screen. I'm lousy with machines. Something's written here. Bird cage game. Free the bird hostage in the cage. Hold down the green switch to raise output to maximum. Don't let your guard down. Wicked masks will come kill those pressing the switch. Shine holy light on the masks. Wait for an opportunity to keep holding. Er, so we just have to hold down this button, but if masks appear, let go and shine holy light? wonder what light it means. There's a flashlight below the machine. Okay! Fucking man, we'll just have to find a new ten year old and name the new one Gin. Alright, well, let's push the button. Do it! What? Looks like it's starting. Oh, fuck! Jesus! It's this kind of game, is it? Well, this sucks. Ah, get the fuck out of here, bastard fruit flies. Great, now what? Oh, good thing we made that save file. Yeah, why can't KG hold the flashlight? This guy's fucking useless. Okay, well there was nothing in there. What if I go to the other rooms first? It's not like they can stop me. Eh, you know what? Maybe we don't need to be in here. Figure that shit out later. Is that another fucking penguin? Why are they both not penguins? I don't understand what you're fucking trying to say here. Too friendly for the passive violence that is pressing. 
lift up the cage. Cage, you're fucking useless. Anyway. <sighs> Fine, I'm gonna save here. Gin, come on, I tried to save you this time. Yeah, I already know this shit. KG, more like KG. Alright, let's fucking do this. Actually, I'll save here. figure this shit out. Even I, who is terrible at video games, can figure this shit out. You dick! They faked me out! Fuck all you guys. This is bullshit. No, I didn't mean to look again. Fuck. 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 I'm just fucking clicking, man. I'm doing my best. No! I hate this. I hate this. Mm. Why is it like this? Okay, select the flashlight ahead of time. This is like the bare minimum of gameplay. Shut up! I'm bad at video games. Don't be a dick. No, I didn't mean to fucking- god damn it. Can you get the fuck out of here? You utter fucking pricks. We're gonna be here for a while, folks. Like, I don't know how to tell you all this, but this is gonna take a thousand years. Where are you, you motherfuckers? Ah, damn it, I've only got- Ah, oh, what the fuck? Sorry, Ken, this game is too hard. I've fun in the cage forever. <laughs> do we really need to save this kid? We do! I don't think it's gonna let me do anything else until we save him. This is true Japanese 8-bit engaging story-driven game design. <laughs> uh, fuck you, you're not worthy, you little shit. Ah, oh, I hate this. I hate this. Get the fuck out! KG, why won't you lift a finger to help out, ever? You never do anything! Where are you, you fucking bastards? I'm gonna do it this time. Fucking watch me. Aw, oh, fuck, I fucking clicked away from the window. God fucking damn it. Shh. 
No, 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 no. No! Fuck off! Are you serious? I was right there, you motherfucker! Oh, I hate this fucking game. Okay. Okay. No, it's okay. I'm gonna do this. The game was rigged from the start. What the fuck? How am I- I don't understand. What is the pattern for them, like, actually hurting me? Cause, like, it seems like they show up for half a second and they hurt me. What's the method here? No, fuck off, god. Not to mention the hit detection is hella fucking suspect. What the fuck? Finally! Fuck! HML is harnessing true gamer energy for this. Flashlight stopped working too. Bullshit. Bet that was scary. It's okay now. Big sis Sarah? Again, it's okay. It's okay. He immediately dies. <laughs> Jesus, I fucking wish. Let's get the hell out of here. Oh my god, my computer just had a fucking seizure. Anyway. Are we still good? We didn't drop any frames. Shit didn't completely go bonkers. The row room. Let's get the fuck out of here. Anyway. No now, huh? Seems the second floor was a bust. Speaking of Joe. Try probing KG. He's gonna suspect something. Don't forget to save. Oh shit, I didn't save. I think now is safe. But her heart's gonna need mending. Come to think of it, you also said there was someone you looked up to. Did I say that? Oh, he's still just barely touching his neck. Do you not want to talk about it? You're really as sharp as a tack. Was means it was someone in his past. I want to know. I want to know more about you, KG. Huh, now that's strange. Trying to evade the question again? Got it, I'll do this. If we survive that main game thing, I'll tell you. Huh? So, you're saying we're really going to do the main game? Doubt it'd be easy to avoid. These people aren't gonna allow that. And once it begins, everyone will be serious. And myself, I don't wanna die either. AG. I don't wanna die either. I'd, I'd hate to die too. Nobody wants to die. It'll be an ugly struggle, that's for sure. Maybe we'll all come to hate each other. But if you survive regardless, and you're still curious about me, I'll be fine with telling you and you alone. Spooky. <laughs> Can't you put your fucking hands down for two seconds? <laughs> what if he fucking kills himself during the game just so he doesn't have to tell her about it? Oh man, wouldn't you just rather die than involve people in an awkward social interaction? Wouldn't you? I'll definitely look for a way to sidestep the main game. Right, just be ready. Anyway. Save. Really dumb. Anyway. To the central hall. Where the f- Are the lights out? That's strange. 
Off we go to... Uh, da, 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 da. Well, I mean, if there was anywhere I'd want to go with a with a box with a box with a head in it, it'd be the bar, right? Never mind, I was wrong. Wait, wait, did something just happen? Okay, whatever. Must be my imagination. Anyway, um. So long as you agree to follow me down this dark alleyway. Oh, I sure am feeling tension. I hope so. Well... We left that guy in the room, didn't we? We left that guy in the room. That was a really bad idea. Why did we do that? Okay. Too bad my lighter ran out of fluid. What about the hidden room? <gasps> so! Oh my god, no, not Beanie Man! It's okay, he's breathing. Get a hold of yourself. So his body is limp. Sarah, check the surroundings. Right. And could you look outside the room? And Ken is dead again. We never did ask him how he got into that cage in the first place. The laptop was here. Wait. Another one? A familiar card. Flip over the card. Sacrifice. quickly return the card to where it was. So, you've come too. Did he see that? Ugh. Ow, did I pass out? He got whacked in the back of the head. Doesn't seem to have caused bleeding, though. It was the doll. Someone at me once the final game starts. <laughs> Kin is... <laughs> I think somebody set their fire alarm off. That's awful. Who would do that? Ah, I've been had. The laptop's gone. It must have been stolen. Did you see what was on it? I didn't figure anything out. Not the password or what data was on it. Oh well. It must have been inconvenient for somebody. So somebody used the confusion to steal it. Somebody on the first floor. Who could that be? Let's find now first. Hold up, Joe's searching the first floor. We shouldn't be hasty just yet. We'll round everyone up. We should take the time to sort things out. My choices have no fucking meaning. Is there someone bad among us? I don't know what's going on. Hey, Miss Sarah, were you looking at something earlier? Dodge the question. I'm gonna dodge the question. I don't know. What are you talking about? Huh, I see. What? Feels like a poor man's dog on Rumpa. Yeah, like with the conversations. We haven't had one of those in a while. We should do that. Kai, how's it going? Where have you been for the past hour? Is something the matter? We were just talking about all meeting up. Come to think of it, Joe was saying to come gather in the bar. Huh. The lights are restored, so I can so at last I can move. Shall we all go together? Was he standing there the whole time, completely silently as we walked through like a fucking psychopath? Is that what he was doing? Was he just fucking there? He heard all of us walk in, he didn't say shit? Fucking Kai. Psst. 
Sarah. Joe, did you find now? She, she wasn't on the second floor? You mean she's up and vanished? Oh no. Looking around the room, I found almost everyone but now had assembled. Just what is going on? Her now, well, everybody calm down. Um, who is the person tied up there? Such an annoying bunch. <laughs> Dude, what is your hair? <laughs> You all plus this now makes everyone right. Ah, hey, you woke up. Move these ropes, so long as you don't want me to crush you. This guy's a little riotous. That's troublesome. Heh, yeah, all chicken, are you? I might have brought in someone dangerous. Talk to him. Uh, do you have a second? Hmm, you. Why is she walking around freely? Hurry, hurry, somebody capture her. What's this all of a sudden? I know. Oh, yes, I do. This girl is bad news. Calm down. Could you start at the beginning? And could you drop that weird tone of yours? Hmm. <laughs> Look at me getting so disconcerted. Is this guy playing a joke on us? Listen, we don't have time to spend on you. But I'll allow a little time for inquiries. We'll decide whether to untie you after that. Say again? Hmm. <laughs> do not try to act as superior blonde rascal. Ooh, scary. You handle the questioning, Sarah. KG, he's not a cop. He's not a cop. He doesn't do fucking anything. He doesn't do cop things. He's not a cop. <laughs> fucking, fucking... We're doing a conversation? We doing this? Mr. Policeman shaking over here. Talk to me whenever you're ready. This is BS. Just a super high school level jerk off. True facts. Yeah, fuck it, let's do this. Conversation time! Wait, what? This is different. Just so it's clear, me and you aren't equals. Don't think I'll obediently listen to you. Inquire. What should I ask him? What's your name? Please, tell me your name. And if I say no? Hmm, he won't tell me. Pacify? Speak calmly, ask him for his say. What do you want to say to us? I'm telling you I want to say nothing. Dickhead. Speak calmly. Ooh. But he's got lopsided hair too. What's your occupation? Well, this is bizarre. I guess I gotta threaten him. Threaten coolly and logically. If you refuse to even talk, I have no obligation to untie you. Wait, wait, they're really chafing me, these ropes. I get it. I'll tell you a little. Seems he's willing to talk now. Cool. What's your name? It's proper for you to give your name first. I'm Sarah Chidoan. Just Sarah is fine. I am. Okay, but like, is like the B pronounced like the Japanese way or like the English way? Is it Gonbi or Gonbei? Yamada. That sounds familiar anyway. <laughs> Who names their child Gonbi? Um, I don't know. Well, it turns out he's gon' be a criminal. Owned. As if yours isn't Cube Taro Hamburger. It's Cube Taro Burger Burp to you. Two E's. Stretch it? What? I don't, I don't understand. That makes it even more confusing. Occupation is there? Uh, well, a salary man. Dressed like that. Ugh. It looks like a prison uniform. I gotta know, do they really still use the fucking striped black and white prison uniforms in Japan? Is that still a thing they do? 
Like, I don't know, man. I know they still do hangings there, so, like, anything fucking goes, but still. Okay. Fair. Fair. That's fair. Japanese uniforms don't use this pattern, and the pajamas are vertically striped. You sure are knowledgeable on the subject. There are fewer than 1,650 people with, in the U.S. with the first name Gombe, according to the fir according to the name website. Oh shit! That means that they're out there. All the Gombies are out there. Why you a trap? Hmm. This person seems quite tiring. I don't think we've seen that pose before. Wow. Even getting told by Kai. Get told. True. I was imprisoned for a somewhat long time after borrowing from people a bit too much. Larceny, then. Surely even you've accidentally perma-borrowed a video game or two, right? I mean, I have. I'm not gonna tell you what game it was, though. That said, I was doing my time diligently as a model prisoner, and yet suddenly I was brought to this place. So even this person is a victim? I know his name and occupation now. I'll try asking something else. What should I ask him? Why were you hiding? Why word it like that? How stupid do you think I am? Hmm, he's mad. Speak calmly? He's pretty mad. Ask him for a say. So mean. Of crocodile tears, yes, it's no use. Ah. Nice. Ah, come on. We could have done that. <laughs> okay, alright, fine. Just like, regular threaten him? I don't know. You want your ropes untied, right? You know what I'm trying to say, don't you? I'm afraid I don't. What kind of attitude is that? He dropped the insult. Nice. Okay, like... Come on. Okay, well... What now? I'm always calm. I'm not your enemy. Can we stop arguing? Mm, true. All it does is make us hungrier. This is no equal conversation. I need to make another push. Nice! I'm a genius. True conversation, wizard. Why were you hiding? When I awoke, I thought to myself, Yikes, this is a big yikes. Indeed. Ooh, I've been getting some yikes lately, too. Uh, the latest comment was one telling me to delete that particular video. Which I won't. I'm not going to do that. Some vocabulary on this guy. A speaker said something about his trial, but it was all foolish. I had already committed myself to hiding. I locked the red door and lay in wait for a long time, just like a tiger waiting for its prey. So he got scared and holed up. However, several times I did hear nearby sounds too dreadful for this world. What were they? Don't try to feign innocence. Huh? Just put your hand to your chest and think. Does Gumby have some miscon- Oh, he heard me with the gun! What do you know about the kidnappers? Before I was brought here, I had rare plans for a visitation. But when I entered the visiting room, no one came. By the time I started to find it odd, my senses were already fading. When you think about it, that's astounding. The organization behind this can free a prisoner? If Gumby is telling the truth, at least. The sounds. Did I ask him? The sounds? I can't let him be freaked out. Okay. Speak calmly. You won't entertain me. Alright. Sarah Chidoan, how many have you laid hands on? What, what do you mean? 
I know your crimes. It's no use playing dumb. Don't be pompous about it. Seems I need a little something more. Okay, anything else? Okay, dickhead. getting somewhere okay well that's not helping I think you've made some mistakes Gumby can we just call him Gumby just to make it easier on me foolish this perfection mistaken that's right it's because you're so perfect that it's easy to assume what what Instigating him is no good. I think I'm gonna step away though. Alright. Okay, well, this isn't helping. What if I. the other one? Yeah, you're the gun. Gumbo, that's a good name. How does someone su survive prison with that haircut? Very carefully. Hold on, haste makes waste, you know? I'll tell you what you wish to know. Yeah, alright. Sounds? What exactly did you hear? The sounds of a gunfight. Say what? My ears caught it. Nine gunshots. As many as nine people died. So does he not know that people can miss when they shoot guns? Or that people can get shot and not die? Ah, that would have been Russian roulette. Oh. I waited for the shots to cease and opened the door to see the situation. And there she stood, the killer wielding a gun. And she stubbornly chased me. Sarah Chidon, it was you! So you got scared and hid, got in a panic because of the gunshot, then saw Sarah with the, re with the revolver, foamed at the mouth, and fainted? Don't give such a biased summary, guys. The more I learn, the more unfortunate he seems. But I can't imagine he's a villain. Will you assist us? Who would assist the likes of... I told him our story so far, and about the Russian roulette game. Say again? All of this was a misunderstanding caused by my too superior insight? Er... I... Yes, that's right. Understood. Untie me. You're gonna help us? Ha <laughs> You're all fools. Who would assist someone they don't even know after hearing about the main game? Someone among you will surely turn traitor, and only soft-hearted fools will die. I can't be the only one thinking that, correct? Joe, what are you doing? What is this meant to be? I've given up on suspecting my allies. Huh? I just can't imagine it, that there's a bad guy among us. Given up on thinking, huh? What do you know about them? Well, yeah, I don't know anything, but it's what my heart says, so what else can I do? I'm not smart anyhow, so I'm gonna believe in this feeling. Heh, <laughs> you say such cheesy things. Whatever, says the dude with that haircut. Oh well, as thanks for untying me, I'll let you go without retaliation. So, no... So, no will to help out. I refuse. But I won't interfere. So long. What the fuck is he gonna do? Yeah, nobody knows what the fuck that was. The mood seemed to be lightning. What about now, though? But I couldn't forget. The person who attacks so is out there. It could have been now, she could have hit him over the head with the box. Yeah, let's split up and look for clues, gang. These kids are useless. Eh, fuck it, why not? Well... It's been about two hours. 
I'm gonna save. Use him as bait. Genius. Anyway, I think I'm gonna get the heck out of here. Because, again, it's been like two hours. So, like, I don't know if I'll be back tomorrow for this. What day is it? It's Thursday. I don't like to stream on Fridays, so... I might not be here tomorrow. I can't make any promises. Anyway, so thank you all for tuning in, and peace.